love you. Quit. Sorry. Love you. Drive home safe. We have literally just got through security and look who's already buying a new pair of sunglasses. I've had my arms for so long. I really have. They're very used, so I will definitely admit. Um, I don't feel like I'm brave enough to pull off sunglasses like that. But you do you, boo. Sure. Do you know what I mean? I just don't feel like it's the same vibe on me. <laughs> Feeling out and John vibes. <laughs> Good morning, angels, and welcome back to another video. It is about 5.45 in the morning at the moment um, on Thursday morning. Me and sis are actually just about to fly off to Lanzarote. We have a really exciting press trip that we're going on today, and I just thought it'd be fun to bring you guys along, obviously, because when would I not? So we've actually had a really uh, fast morning in the airport actually we haven't really stopped it is so busy in here today like we also just found this sky lounge which is showing the most gorgeous sunrise at the moment it's so pretty and yeah so cute so if you're in bristol airport you know where to come hun yeah so we actually even paid a little bag just to fast our security because it was literally that busy and honestly do you know what i think if we hadn't have done that yeah we'd probably only just make it through and we have like 10 minutes until we we're gave bored. each other the look like so we're gonna have to just, just do it, it. We both agree. So yeah, not a very relaxing shopping y kind of vibe in the airport today. I think we are gonna quickly just pop into Superdrug um to get some sweets for the plane. And I kind of also want to have a look in the book shop just to see if there is a good book to read. What would you rather do? Bookshop or sweets? I don't mind. Sweets. Okay. I'd rather actually food rather than sweets. Okay, sis, what sort of thing are you feeling? Chicken. Yeah. We swapped rolls, hun. See what I mean, angels? It's literally like oh, so busy in here today. So this is the book I actually read in Lanzarote when we came a couple of weeks ago. It is so, so good. Um, I was kind of a bit reluctant to start a new author because I love Jodie Pickle. Me and Sis actually love Jodie Pickle, don't we, Sis? She's the best. But Emily recommended this one and it was really good. And also, I've read this one. I read that in America. That's an amazing book. Such an eye-opener, really. And they do do, like, a second version of this book as well um, called A Stranger in the House. But I can't see it anywhere. Oh my goodness, I literally don't even know what I want. Where's the chicken? Here. Oh, sis, are you alright mate? It's actually 5.45am, sis, get a chicken I'd kebab hun. I'd, I'd rather eat savoury than sweet. Nah, never. Yeah, I would. Mind you, carrots and hummus. Yeah, okay. Really like hummus. Oh yeah, and that's like a nice healthy snack as well. Yeah. Do you know what, sis? I am actually in the mood for a smoothie. Oh my god, like, can't relate hun. Oh, sis? I'm sorry. <laughs> Love smoothies. You don't mm. like these? I do, sis, but not at 5.45 in the morning. Might get a magnificent mango. That sounds a bit of me today. Vitality shot or something. Get up and go. Yeah. Full me. of sugar. A fructose, sis. Rather than sucrose, but you wouldn't know the difference, would you? No, I wouldn't. Of course, sis, I'm going to full on pack lunch. Don't read. Really, yeah, I have to, sis, you know. Oh my god, who remembers these? Oh. Snuffy Ham and cheese. No, hey sis, what is your favourite puzzle to do? Mine's a Sudoku. Honey, I don't know who you think I am. I sis, what? Are you literally alright? Yeah, puzzle queen. I'm not a puzzle queen. Sis, back in the day, come on. Oh, You're more of an artist. <laughs> Bless you. I'm more of a creative. Yeah, I'm more academic. Yeah, true. How can you not get hay fever? Since I do get hay fever, but just not in the middle of an airport. There's no plants around. <laughs> Gonna be my plain snacks. Do you know what? I feel like Con would actually be so proud of me. I feel like he would literally say, why do you not get this sort of stuff when I'm around? When I'm with Con, I literally get like a massive bag of magic stars, Pringles. I mean, you guys obviously know. Today I've gone for a mango smoothie and then I've actually just got this 5-1 chocolate brownie bar. Um, just because me and Lucy just kind of came to the conclusion that we're on the plane and we have like a massive bag of chocolate to scoff. We just feel so bloated, especially when it's like 7 a.m. And then Lucy is basically a fridge full of meat over here. <laughs> Three bags of chicken. I might not eat them all. Uh, five and one bar and some fruit gums. Nice. I'm gonna get water. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get water as well. Couldn't help it. 
caved and bought some tank fast sticks. I just thought, mm, yeah, honey, get me those cherries. Okay, so now I think it's actually time to board. So tired. Do you know what? I think it's actually because me and Katie filmed that um, <laughs> eating what the person in front of us ordered video yesterday. So I literally, yesterday, I've got a massive spot there, by the way. Nice. Um, I literally had like Domino's, McDonald's. I just don't feel good today, you know? I feel really sluggish. So we've, so snap you five a day. Getting on. to our gorgeous hotel it is absolutely stunning in here it's literally such a vibe you can literally see the beach right from our balcony i'll show you guys around now our little suitcases have just arrived in here so here we have a sofa a little footstool and a tv and then you come out onto this balcony and you have a hot tub oh my gosh vibey and then the infinity pool out there with the sea such a nice for you really love that so much um come back in here to this side you have the bathroom so in there is a toilet and then in there is a shower wardrobe um sis who is living it up like a spa queen the bed which we've sort of already made messy and then out here you have another little seating area which is so cute so i think the plan now is um i'm just gonna unpack and then we're really hungry aren't we sis this is starving. If you can't tell by her silence over there, she's literally about to kick off because she's hungry. Um, I'm gonna have a shower as well. We'll go and get some lunch and then wait for everybody else to arrive because we're the first people here at the moment. So yeah, we're just like chilling out. And also I have my fake tan on, which I haven't actually showered off. Um, when we got up at three o'clock this morning, I was obviously gonna shower it off, but then I realized it had only been on for six hours and it hadn't really gone as dark as I had liked. So I made the decision to wait until we were here. And I was wearing a white, set as well but look it hasn't even really come off at all at all actually which is so good this is the um aero tan by bondi sands and i really like it by the way oh my goodness you lot are literally gonna be so mad as you know this suitcase was literally brand new and look what happened on her little first trip it's always gonna happen sis i know i just do you know what i mean thanks a lot ryanair poor girl I'm not really that bothered, but I mean, my little cute suitcase. I'm gonna try my best to clean her. And I might even get like a protective cover, but can you see like the glitter? I told her something I love about the suitcase. This was from TK Maxx. Yes, she did tell me to wrap it in cling film, sis, but it was too late. I'm gonna to have to do that next time. Um, but yeah, time to unpack. <gasps> oh, sis. At least it was over that. And was, is that as deep as it goes? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, sis. Oh my god. I'm Blue soak shampoo. It. Will that work, do you think? On the cardi. Oh, sis, that was such a nice cardi as well. Oh, stop. I know. Oh my god. That's the only cardigan I've got. Have you bought any other cardigans? No. Have you bought any cardigans? No. Oh, okay. We'll be cold together then. Yeah. Loving my little packing situation up here. I bought these bags. If you guys have watched my pack with me, you'll know I bought these packing bags from Amazon and they're literally like so useful when it comes to keeping your suitcase nice and tidy and also with these ones as well so i just always put my lotions and glasses and everything in there we've got some cotton pads and hair ties and everything in that one toiletries in this one and then this gorgeous makeup bag which is actually so good for traveling um again in my packing video i'll leave links to all of these in the description box below spoken in a while um we have had a bit of a random day to be honest um basically we are here with two other people one of them is the lovely pr woman that we have come out here with the company and then the other one is another influencer really really lovely girl called elena and elena has been doing some shooting this afternoon and me and lucy haven't needed to do our shooting today because we we'll start tomorrow so we have kind of like had the afternoon to ourselves today so we went out for some lunch and then we went back to the room and had a nap now we've got ready and we have literally just come out to the hotel buffet where we're meeting the other two girls and we're gonna have some nice dinner in there by the way how cute 
is that yeah the decor in the hotel is actually something else and so do those desserts look incredible oh, right. oh i've literally oh, I've got so far, we love a hotel buffet, don't we, sis? Oh, yeah. Can't wait to see the breakfast well. You know, on the breakfast hotel buffet, it's like something else. Yeah, I'm really excited. So, let's go and show you guys. Because we're having it together in these vlogs, you know. So, we have just sat down for dinner. And we're actually on a really huge table. It's so cute what the hotel have done. But, unfortunately, it's just the four of us today. Um, so, here's my name. Cute little chocolate heart. Adorable. Okay, step number one at the hotel buffet we have an asian corner over here over there we have so much more food but i think me and Tess are going to stick to asian course for number one right um some stunning stuff over here i won't lie actually i've changed my mind i've got two prawn crackers and i've come on over to the uh italian section where they're cooking loads of meats i'm gonna get some carbonara they also do bolognese oh my goodness angels aren't hotel buffets literally the best thing in the world I am literally freaking out right now. It's so nice. OMG, Angels, look at the size of this portion. It is huge. Can you get some fresh grated cheese up on there? Oh my god, 10 times more than that, hon. Okay, time for dessert. Oh la la. Oh my goodness. Look, wow, look at those profiteroles. Oh my god, ice cream. Over here. Oh my, look at this stuff, isn't it neat? Wouldn't you say my collection's complete? Cheese and biscuits. Me and sis said we won't do that tonight, but we will do that another night. And then over there, there's a little bit more fruit. I just don't know what I'm gonna go for, you know, guys. What's that? What's that? Oh my god, yummy. Okay, so my method of doing dessert at hotel buffets is just to like try a bit of everything and then you know for the rest of the night's what you like. I think that might be custard, you know. I like this. We've got lots of different cakes on here, some marshmallows, we've got a, a, a few profiteroles over here, we've got a brownie. Wow. Um, yeah, it's looking really good. Hopefully it's going to be fab. Good morning everybody. It is now the morning. We had a very, very, very good sleep. Me and sister in bed literally by like half nine. Um, I had a quick FaceTime with Herbie and Connor and then we literally woke up about 10 minutes before we came to breakfast, as you can probably tell by my face this morning. Nice puffy eyes, the Kiehl's eye cream has not yet been applied. Very, very excited to start the hotel breakfast this morning. As this is actually already tucked straight in to some beans. Oh yes, this is a bit of you in there. You loving your life. Um, and I'm loving my life. Do you know why? Because they do Nutella pancakes at this hotel buffet breakfast. Yeah, so I'm out here living my best life. Um, it's so cool out here. You know, I wish you were here. So look at all this food. You've got pancakes, croissants, a giant pot of Nutella, which I am definitely here for. Sprinkles, oh my goodness. Bacon, eggs, scrambled eggs. You've even got some churros over here and then you've got like all of the uh fried breakfast bits around her beans oh sausages and then over here you have some like muesli pieces um cheeses donuts muffins yeah yeah what's around here fruit oh my goodness yum yum in my tum um yogurt quinoa didn't even know that was breakfast food but okay you know what we're living for it some more fruit around here um hummus guacamole go on and then you've got some cute meat pieces so yeah very good hotel breakfast buffet. i'm gonna just go and get my first dish now Okay, 500 pancakes later and we are ready for the day. Not sure about 500. Me, I did. I had, had 500 grams of Nutella and 500 pancakes as well. So, feeling nice and full today. Yeah, we just got ready. Um, we have a big morning of getting some brand pictures today, which is one of the big reasons why we are here in Lanzarote. So, we're working with a few different brands. Um, sorry if it's really windy. And yeah, we're doing a big photo shoot for it all this morning. So that's why, this is my beach get up this morning not my usual you know um it's gonna be nice to have a full day in the hotel this is honestly like such a lovely lovely hotel i'm so impressed with it so far the breakfast and dinner have been amazing the pool looks gorgeous the pool bar is insane the meals we were just yesterday 
so yeah i'm very excited for another day and um it's time to get my modeling on my non-existent model life Days without water and long the sun so grown. Okay. Shooting is all done. Sorry if it's incredibly windy, I feel like it might be. Um, but yeah, our shoot this morning is all complete. We are now just chilling out by the pool. Water aerobics is going off. Angel, let me tell you that it is like. Can you hear them? Come on guys, they were working real hard. And um, yeah, we're literally just chilling out because we said to each other like, we don't actually ever really allow ourselves to just relax, like especially on brand trips and stuff. Um, so let's just take a break from like work and editing and doing stuff and let's just like relax on the sunbed, so that's what we're doing. We're gonna have lunch in a minute. I'm very excited, that pool bar is, the hummus is spot on. So I'm just waiting around for that really. And then this afternoon we're gonna go on the dolphin trip. So that's gonna be so amazing. If you guys already didn't know, um, when I was young, like a child, dolphins were my favorite animal in the whole entire world. And I actually adopted like three. You know when you can like adopt a, a dolphin or like a donkey? I adopted like three dolphins and I've always really wanted to pet dolphin. And uh, my love for them has never really gone away. I guess they're like really similar to dogs, aren't they? So, yeah, I just love them so much. I'm very excited to go and see some later, hopefully. Fingers crossed. Okay, it is officially lunchtime and we have all ordered bread on bread on bread. Um, this hummus is literally to die for. I won't lie, Angels. It is the nicest hummus I think I've actually ever tried. Um, and then also, I have some more pizza bread coming for my main, so that's great. And this is exactly the same, except it's cheese and I've got beef on my pizza. So, yeah. And of course we have the pineapple juice and lemonade. I'm literally obsessed with pineapple juice this trip. I don't know what it is. I'm just a big fan, you know? Okay, who is ready for a dolphin trip? Me. Got my glam sunnies on, got my glam earrings in, hair has gone back into a bun. Literally, angels, you know I literally never wear my hair in like a proper scraped back bun like this but this is the, like the only hairstyle that we can really have on this boat trip literally we just went out and sat by the pool this afternoon and it was so windy my hair was like matted it was pretty gross so yeah we both have buns um i've popped on my new favorite lip gloss which i'm gonna show you guys now oh my goodness it is a must have it's my favorite i bought it the other day it's the kylie i think they're called high glosses I don't know that could be me getting confused between kylie and fenty but yeah it's just this lip gloss and it's in shade yes girl i also bought a few lip kits from there um but the glosses are definitely my favorite um i also bought this one which is like a really pink tone focusing but yeah it's a really nice pink tone and this is called oh you fancy is it oh you fancy and then also obviously my number one glow product has had to come with me on this trip. This is the Fenty Beauty Body Lava and Shade Who Needs Clothes. And this is just an absolute dream. I love it so much. Would not go anywhere without it now. Um, and yeah, we're ready to go on our boat trip. Sis is there waiting to vlog. We'll Wait, take a so selfie. I, vlog, I can't, because if Ellie's vlogging, she has to go at me if I start. So I'm that actually vlogging. is true, actually, because she interrupts us. The angels having a conversation. Oh, this is my outfit. Oh, sorry, sis. Beat you to she it. Is. She's in the mirror showing you guys, show, not you guys, showing her angels, her outfit, and I was going to do exactly the same. So I am going to come and show you my outfit because I think it's so nice. This jumpsuit I got from ASOS. I did have to size up. I got a size 10 and it did not fit this area. So I got a size 12 in it, but I just think it's so nice and so easy to throw on. It is lush. Oh, thanks, sis. No, sis likes it when I give her compliments. You. Tell everyone what you did. I actually did a really big order on ASOS. Just, I'm basically just copied Lucy's wardrobe. I literally bought... Actually, it won't feel like much when I show them your, your wardrobe like this because I didn't get much from, from the wardrobe. here. But I got this white dress, I got a bikini, I got a swimsuit, I got a kimono. She loved what I wore, basically. I was hashtag influenced. And I mean, would I really be doing my duty as a younger sister 
if I didn't literally copy everything that my big sis wears. Lucy's actually always been a very big fashion icon of mine. Like sis. Um, yeah. Have you got Oh, sis, oh my god, good remembering. You. Good remembering. We have to take our towels, guys, otherwise it's literally just going to be so cold. And um, we're not right, wants to be cold, are we, sis? No, we're quite resilient, really. But it's windy here, so. Yeah. This is actually a lot windier, we've come to the conclusion, this area of Lanzarote, um, than where we usually go. So we're in Costa Telgis at the moment, and we usually go to... I don't know why I keep calling it Telgis. <laughs> is that another place, sis, or does no, that just not exist? No. Very windy, as you can tell. I'm sure you can hear that wind. Um, yeah, usually we stay in Puerto del Carmen. I do think, like, Puerto del Carmen is still my favourite, you know? I, that place always has a place in my heart. Gorgeous hotel. Views. Sis, what do you actually think of this hotel? Oh, it's a, it's a gorgeous hotel, isn't it? Absolutely stunning hotel. Two yeah. lovely pools, yeah, so nice. a cute beach, lovely rooms. Yeah, it's gorgeous. Nice dinner. Oh, the food Breakfast. is impeccable, really. Yeah, it's lovely. It's so nice. They've got a lovely marble reception, which I'm going to show you guys now. Yeah, lots and lots of really nice picture opportunities. I definitely recommend it. And if I haven't said already in this vlog, we're staying at the Barcelo hotel i can't remember what it's called but it's barcelo here are the girls looking glam for our boat trip look at these velvet sofa angels beauty and the beast roses oh my god what a vibe beautiful 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 hotel here's our boat guys oh my goodness everybody is walking down go oh my god i literally hate walking downhill oh sorry mr bad boy our boat extreme fire whoa oh my goodness we cried over border good morning angels and welcome back to the last full day of lanzarote here in this vlog um so i haven't really vlogged as much this morning because we literally woke up went to breakfast um, I got ready, I put makeup on, and then I had to go and do a little bit of shooting down at the beach, and then we literally just came back, it's, I think it's like 11 o'clock now, um, and we're just going to go and chill out by the pool for the rest of the day, so I didn't feel like that was like much fun vlogging that, because you guys saw exactly that same thing yesterday. Skin's looking nice and fresh because I have literally just moisturised. I'm using this really good new facial moisturiser at the moment that I am loving, it has SPF. 30 in it i think bought it from kiehl's the other day i have actually spoken about this a lot on my instagram stories so if you guys don't watch my instagram stories then i would recommend doing that because that's when like i usually speak about a lot of the beauty stuff that i'm using um and pieces that i would recommend to you guys but yeah i've just been using this one i literally love it so much i was using a clarins one no Cl no it was clarins i always get confused between clarins and clinique um yeah i've been using this one i was using clarins before but uh, this one has a higher SPF and also it feels, as you can see, like my skin looks really glowy at the moment because I've literally just applied it and it feels so soft and so nice. Um, and I really like the fact that when I put it on, like it makes me feel as though I have moisturised, if you know what I mean. Whereas the Clarins one that I was using, it was really, really good, but it was very lightweight and I didn't really feel as though I'd actually moisturised after, you know. Um, and then also on this trip, I've also been using a few more pieces from kiehl's because basically i bought that because emily was using that on the um on the airplane home from lanzarote oh no on the airplane to lanzarote or something and she was using it in lanzo yeah there we go it's just that one um and she let me borrow it and i needed a new uh moisturizer anyway so i bought that one and then when you buy something from kiehl's you can get free samples so i got samples of the midnight recovery concentrate oil and also the eye cream that you use at night time that goes with it um and i literally loved those samples so so much i actually cannot explain to you like how nice my skin is at the moment like i'm literally i'm so happy with it lucy actually said the other day like i literally can't get over how nice your skin is at the moment and i was like i know like honestly this time last year i would have been crazy for skin like how mine is now and i honestly think it's just down to treating it really nicely drinking a lot of water um obviously like i do still get breakouts this is just like a random spot that never actually like came to be a spot if you know what i mean it's just like a lump um 
and that's just like that's not even a spot that's just like a stain on my face i don't really know what that is um but yeah i do still get breakouts and stuff but honestly just the texture of my skin is so nice at the moment and then i also just use this eye cream as well for the daytime and again i'm loving that it's really brightening actually um really love that one so much so i definitely recommend i heard so many people raving about keel skincare for such a long time and i was like mm, don't know because it's kind of a little bit expensive it's not exactly cheap so i was just kind of like yeah boo like you do you you know if you like it go for it but honestly like i am loving it so much so yeah anyway lucy has been waiting for me down at the pool for a while now so i'm gonna go and join her there and then this afternoon we have a really really nice chill out afternoon we're gonna go to the sports bar for lunch um p.s omg can i just say so many of you guys have been to this hotel like i've been checking my dms guys there have been so many of you saying like oh my god i love that hotel so much it is honestly such a gorgeous hotel the only thing is that the weather has really sort of let us down it is so windy it's actually a joke like do you know when you go outside and it's windy and then your hair your hair is like completely fresh but then you've been outside and it like is a hundred times greasier do you know what i mean because of the wind that's how it is at the moment so yeah as much as i love lanzarote i don't actually think we're going to be coming back next year um lucy is like adamant that she's not going to so i don't know i think next year anyway we're going to go somewhere really nice for her 30th because she's the big three zero next year she's getting old um so yeah, i don't know if we're going to be coming back but i wouldn't really like be that annoyed because the weather this year has just really let us down it's like not been really that sunny and hot anyway yeah loads of you guys have said that you've come to this hotel and apparently the sports bar is amazing we've not been there yet um so i'm excited and then also this afternoon we're going to the spa and then we're just having a nice dinner and on honestly angels can i just tell you i have been fully converted back to all inclusive me and connor are um looking to book somewhere nice to go away at some point in july like for an actual holiday not for work or anything like that and um con has been like oh i really really want to do all inclusive and i'm kind of like yeah okay like i don't mind but i'm not really that crazy like i would rather go honestly to like some like somewhere like greece where you can go to really lovely restaurants and stuff but honestly at this hotel was all, all inclusive it has fully converted me back it is so, though boo listen you really just cannot beat a dessert at an all-inclusive holiday do you know what i mean or like the breakfast oh it's just so incredible pancakes every day hon although this morning they didn't have them i was like really upset so yeah anyway let's go before i just talk my life away i swear you guys are like yeah yeah eddie come on leopard sunnies oh yeah boo extra yes, i am literally loving this swimming costume so much G, i am obsessed i love it so much angels honestly look at this wind <sighs> Me and sis are having a bit of a nightmare, having to use our towel as our blanket. It is lunchtime finally, and me and sis are sharing a lot of food over here. We are chicken quesadillas, um, this like pork barbecue sandwich, some nachos. The food in here is actually really, really yummy. I'm so excited to eat. Oh my goodness! Look at this dessert. Sissy's gone for brownie with a walnut, and just got a can of JD there. She's going down that. <laughs> Oh, that came in my name. No, she that specific. That's no, I didn't. Uh, Miss Apple Party Queen. Okay, angels, it is now the evening and it is time for our final dinner here in Lanzarote. Um, I'm very excited for the buffet. The buffet is literally what we have been living for um, on this holiday. So tonight, this is my look. We've gone for a bit of a different Annie Derby kind of look my angels. First of all, we've got a red lip. Yeah, so as we all know, I literally hardly ever wear a red lip. I'm always a nude kind of gal, gloss kind of gal. I bought the shade from Kylie Cosmetics, and I actually really, really like it. I only like some red tones with my skin. Um, I just kind of find that like without a tan, they really wash me out. So yeah, and then I've also gone for short hair tonight because drama. I did. I had a huge drama, and my sister kind of had to calm me down. Um, first of all, I tried to do basically loads of different hairstyles with extensions and they just weren't working. First of all, I tried to do like a half up, half down kind of thing. Hated it. Um, just like didn't look right. You know when you do extensions, they just like don't look right and they look really just horrible. And then I just tried to have like down and curly and it wasn't working. So my sister finally just convinced me to have it like down and curly without extensions so let me know what you guys think i actually am thinking of getting my extensions put back in like my long extensions because i just really miss having long hair i don't know i kind of just like i'm over my short hair now you know so um yeah and then this is the look 
this top is absolutely stunning i'm so obsessed with it this is from like a, a new brand i think called riona i think that's how you pronounce it i'm not entirely sure um but they very kindly gifted me this top as well as a beautiful dress all their dresses are like seamless um really really an amazing like high quality fabric but yeah i brought this top out to lanzarote with me because i'm just so obsessed with it i think it looks so nice with these shorts so these are from nasty gal um and then just my li little kitten heels which are from zara and then my gucci bag so this is my look sis are you dressed yeah and then this is sis's look oh love it Gorgeous, sis. You just can't beat a bit of denim shorts for me. Just trying to do it at the button, sis. I think they're so nice. Let me stop vlogging and I can do it up. Hey, angels. Okay, sorry if you can hear like a bit of mumbling in the background. Lucy is just editing her vlog right there. Um, so I am actually going to go ahead and finish off today's video because I'm going to get started on editing this vlog for you guys so I can get it up tomorrow morning. Wow, you guys have just seen so many unflattering angles of me. <laughs> Here's another one, babe. Love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Another Lanzarote vlog. They seem to be your guys' favourites. So yeah, I really hope you enjoyed it. This one is definitely different, like obviously the other ones, because this is a PR trip. But I thought it would be interesting to bring you guys along and you can kind of see like behind the scenes of the of the PR trips and stuff. So yeah, I am obviously going to Barcelona tomorrow. I'm going on Monday. Um, and I'm going to be there until Thursday with a different group of gals and a different um, PR company and stuff. So it's going to be really, really fun. So I will obviously bring you guys along on that as well. Um, I'm unsure if there's actually going to be a video on Tuesday just because obviously I'm traveling on Monday. And I think I just want to do one Barcelona vlog. So I'm not sure what the content will be. Um, so yeah, sorry if there's no video on Tuesday, but there will definitely be a, a Barcelona vlog on Thursday, so don't worry about that. But yeah, I love you guys so, so much. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!